Hey guys, welcome to the construction site on Friday. Today we are doing the bitumen mass on the garage. You can see Patrick here is mixing a bucket of bitumen. Really cool. Alright, so we are applying the primer and fighting a bit with the water. Here we're going to dry it out using a burner, using a propane burner and uh, hopefully we can apply the bitumen in, uh, on the uh, tar paper with a single pass so a much thicker layer uh, maybe some will be excess wasted but uh, that way we can escape from the water hopefully all right all right guys the first uh, bucket of bitumen is done the guys went to eat breakfast you can check out we went on the foundation foot on the wall and the tar paper all the way around here and the bit behind the corner just to finish off the bucket right up to there so the plan is to go all the way around on the foundation foot and the tar paper to do a really thick layer so we're not worried about some splashing or water coming up because it's the ground is wet and the water keeps creeping in all the time but then we can do the second layer and not be worried on the foundation foot wall that's the part that is black now the vertical part so yeah and then we can even backfill a little bit so if it uh, gets really cold at night nothing will happen stuff like that but I doubt still will have to be like minus degrees for a long time I think for the ground to freeze under the foundation but still and then the uh, foundation top of the foundation foot and the foundation wall will leave for seconds if we have time today or maybe next week when the weather gets nice again it's going to rain tomorrow and uh, continuing raining over next week so that's why we're doing this now just hustling <laughs> but yeah it's going well uh, we have to fight the water a bit with pumps and the burner and you can see over here was just dry a moment ago it was dry over here just a moment ago right over here but uh, you can see the water start to creep in again so So we're using a combination of uh, brushing it out, drying it out with the burner, sponging it out and stuff like that just to keep it dry. And then we pile on the bitumen and yeah, it's going pretty good. Alright guys, here we go. The most fatal side. The hardest part. The biggest problem here is uh, the sidewalls and sand is collapsing inside the trench. That's hurting us big time. But we're managing to get this working. I think we're on our third bucket of bitumen and uh, yeah I asked the guys to put on the second layer from this side so we can stop being worried about water because there's water coming up over here over here in the ditch and over here in the ditch the water is constantly rising and uh, the guys put in the second layer on the walls all the way around here so we can uh, forget about this part and focus on the other ones and uh, yeah, the work is going pretty well. Here we have one layer uh, from over there onwards and up to here is the second layer. This is where it ended because this was too fresh to put in the second layer. The second layer goes much faster. A 
All right, guys, we managed to get through the trench here with the bitumen mass. The tar paper is thick, two layers, maybe an overkill, but really that's like the most critical part because that's where uh, the tar paper and the concrete meet. So if the concrete is to pull up water, it will probably get through there because it's easy to do a solid layer of uh, bitumen on the wall. So yeah. So we've got all of this nice and black. One layer on the foundation, two layers on the uh, tar paper. And here the guys are preparing the front. So we can start from the mudroom and work our way towards the garage and meet over there. So, really good. Hey guys, it's almost uh, the end of the day and we're all the way up to the main house with the bitumen mass up front. The guys are now on the back applying the second layer. This and it looks like we'll be done today with the foundation footing on the side so that we're no longer depending on the water. We cut ourselves off from it and we can then later on do the walls. So yeah, really, really cool. Mr. Pava is doing the, uh, the tape that goes on the break between the foundations. So basically this uh, tape is uh, like a rubbery uh, coated with some felt, I guess. Rubbery material that stretches. So when the building wants to move in relation to each other, then it will stretch and will not break the bitumen seal. That's the, at least the idea or the purpose of it so that we can have a continuity on the waterproofing even if uh, one building settles differently from the other. Alright guys, the bitumen is done with two layers. <laughs> really cool. Awesome. So uh, thank you guys very much for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.